we're here at Turkey Reserve number four. Uh, so, parked like that. Tried to get up in there. Actually, I turned around and I hit that tree tree there. <laughs> so, uh, walk over here for a sec. Stay. Mm. No, I don't see any. Any boo boos. I gotta wash my truck though. This is Turkey Reserve number four. This is the one where the homeless people had an encampment. I'll go up here and see if the that the the park if the park people uh, removed the piss bottles and the uh, tent. This is like the first one when I start, had them when they were little pups. Uh, when I had Rocky and Precious as pups. This is the first one I came to. Because uh, normally the other two had somebody parked there or something. So come out here. Yep. You okay, babes? You okay? Come on. I want you two to sleep good tonight. Yeah, it's a little walk back here. Little branches off because he had the wings up on the other, on the thing and sliced off. what they used to come but it looks like whatever it was maybe it's oh one of those old type of uh, cutters maybe where they had the blades that went back and forth like so For like hay and whatnot, because that's why all these limbs and trees are cut off it. Look at this! Look at that wild animal going ah. Yeah, get up here and because when we first first come up here, uh, some guy over here in this area had the turkey blind put up a turkey blind. Take a look, there's a nice field. And I bring them up here to run around. Yeah, the turkey blind would have been right about that area. Yep. Yeah, okay. Makes sense now. He had one of the old type that had wings, wings, but the, but back in that corner there, wonder if they cleaned it up where those pine trees are, is where they had the, uh, The homeless encampment. 
couple lawn chairs, a tent, uh, piss bottles. Here's, here's the milkweed. Milkweeds. This is milkweed. That feels like cotton. Those seed. See, look how they float in the air. They'll replant themselves and grow next year. Yep, some of them will go go really far. If you can get them to get in the wind, they'll travel. To me, this looks like tobacco. This here. I don't think so. Oh yeah, it's still here. Still here. I'm surprised to come out here and clean it up. So. Yep. I didn't come out here and clean it up uh, at all. It's just... There's, there's one, two chairs, um, water bottles, and I know there's pee bottles back there. Uh, and then that tent or blind or whatever it is. So... Somebody say was living here for a little while. And here, here's some more. There's whatever that is. Uh, looks like some damaged poles because of the because of the storms we had. Uh, just wondering, if there's any more back, back that way? But yes, somebody was living up here in, in the woods for a little while anyway. Uh, I would say it would be a deer deer blind or, or a turkey turkey blind. But oh, lady, oh. Get it out. Get it out. Don't take it home with us. Oh. You're allergic. You're allergic to the grass. That big pile of grass there. Be perfect for a snake to be up in there. But anyway, yeah, that's that's one of, one of the homeless homeless in camp. Well, tents. Can't see encampment because nobody was ever here. They would uh, come here and there would be chairs set up. There would be water bottles, that, like like they would be off hiding in the woods or something. And then you leave, and then they would come back. Like they didn't want nobody to know that they were there. Look at all this. What is this? I wonder what this is. This this type of plant. Just noodles of them. It looks like, like I don't know. They look like something that you would hang up in a, and, and dry it out, and then smoke it. <laughs> there was tons of, as you can see, milkweed. Tons of milkweed. What are you looking for, Rocky? You're looking for the way out. Hmm. One of the places he'd come and pitch a tent. As you've seen already over there.
But it doesn't look bad. Not, not, not too bad. It's just... I know the older, older gener, the older generation, the older guys that used to do this back when I first come up here. Yeah, they took pride. They took pride in their work. These young, young guys, they want to get it quick and done, and you know, there were for the old guys, there would have been none of, none of that there left. Wouldn't have been that, like out in there, them, them spots. Wouldn't, wouldn't have been. No, nope. the older generation took pride in their, in their field. Young, young bucks. They just want to get it done to get it done so they can go back to doing whatever they were doing in the first place. Yep, so whatever they brought up through here, cut cut the trail down, cut the trail down on either side, just basically clipping limbs, clipping limbs off, coming down through, and then obviously he had to get off, off his tractor to push this stuff over into the woods. Well, at least that made more firewood if you come up here and want to get some kindling or smaller stuff. You can get this here. This stuff here. See, here's some kindling or smaller stuff. Put it over there. But anyway, this is uh, the... Turkey Reserve number four, and yeah, so we had a for a short time some homeless people, but they never come back. Never come back for the. So that's why I consider them homeless because a, a, a true uh, sportsman or or a turkey person or a hunter would have come back because what that, those aren't ex those are expensive, aren't they? So tell me down below in the comments, are those expensive, like over 200 bucks? And then the lawn chairs. Get them at Walmart. Yeah, look, he come through here and really clipped this side. He really clipped this side because, yeah, right there, look at that. He clipped that. Maybe maybe what we tried to do is put the blades down to get more more area, but that could be a possibility. And then he just because he's clipped clipped clipped. Yep. Wow wow, it even went through that thickness. Look at that thickness. Look at that thickness, man. What is he trying to destroy the, the 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 old piece of equipment so he don't have to work? That's what I, I think. Trying to destroy something with that thickness, four or inches thick. That, that that's almost two inches to two inches thick there. Cut it, snap off. Yep. Yep. Just amazing. Amazing these younger generation. You got the little stuff here. Uh, well, at least I know where to come get some little, little stuff. Put it on the back of my truck to start fires with. Yeah. Nice little walk back here and then 
<sighs> I'm surprised people don't have parties. Well, it, 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 it's not only like five minutes away from town. Well, not five minutes. Maybe, maybe more like 15, 15 minutes. But people, people don't come out here unless, unless they want to, uh, relations. Uh, they need a place for relations. Um, they don't want their spouses knowing. Um, come out here and walk the dogs. Most old people, if they get, they get stuff they can't eat at home from the farmer's market, the Amish mall, uh, they'll come up here and go out for the, for the, uh, animals. But what gets me is they will throw it in the beginning part of the, of the, where the gate is. They will throw it in the, where they pull up the vehicle, like they can't, like they don't have the mobility to get out of the vehicle and place it. They just chuck it out the window as driving by. Yeah. Nice. I don't know, you could have a whole party up there, you know. I mean, a huge, huge party. Maybe even a bonfire. Um, um, but I think they do that more over at the uh, the uh, the hang glider place. The hang glider where, where they would have the tents and stuff, and then they have that center thing for where the ring is. But I think they have like campfires there when there's a group of people and they hang glide off that that launch pad, uh, uh, Helios, Helios 1, they call it, or Helios 2, I'm like standing there, Helios 1, okay, why don't you just call it Helios, because if you have Helios 1, that me think that there's more than one spot here in the area that you could say Helios 2, Helios 3, but I have not seen any or found any. So, healer pad. But, uh, I think most of, these, like, most of these are designed for emergency purposes. That's what I would assume in the long run of things that these could be used as evacuation sites. They just disguise them as a turn, turn north, northwest. Alright, you two. I hear somebody coming. Hey, get up in there. Somebody's coming. I don't need you to be in grease spots. Yep. Wave. They waved. Yeah? You're going to sleep good tonight. Little Mr. Devil. All messing with me while I'm doing an MRE review. Alright. I'll see you in the next one. Uh, you know what to do. So, uh, yeah.